All right. All right. Welcome, everybody, uh, to the third Sec IC meeting. Woo. Glad everyone came out to, to hang out with us and uh, eat some pizza and learn some tech stuff. So, what is Sec IC? Uh, we are the first chapter of Sec DSM. Uh, we are a city Sec. Um, we are also a now a registered 501c3 public charity. Um, more importantly, we have swag. Talk to us. <laughs> no. Buy stuff from us. Um, disclaimer, uh, we don't con condone any illegal activity. So uh, we talk about hacking, we talk about infosec. Uh, don't do it here. Uh, do it on your own network. Um, if you get in trouble, it wasn't us. Um, code of conduct, don't be an ass. Uh, board members have say in what that constitutes. Just be cool. And try and keep it PG-13. So. So, business in the front, party in the back. Um, talks are up here. We've got pizza all the way in the back. And then we've got drinks around the corner. Um, alcohol is only if you're 21 and over. If you're not, we've got soda for you. And bathrooms are to the left around the corner. Uh, any first timers here tonight? First timers? Awesome. Feel free to grab some stickers. Uh, that goes for people who aren't here for the first time. <laughs> Sponsors. Uh, tonight's sponsor is Merge. It's the place we are at. Um, if you're looking for a, a what is it, a co-working space, they, they rent space out here. You can get an office, you can get a desk. <laughs> I should probably know that. Um, <laughs> sponsorship opportunities are available. If you would like to sponsor us, um, I swear I'll get your information right. Uh, send an email to contact in second. <laughs> Tonight's agenda, uh, we're a little bit delayed, but we always are. So uh, 101 is right now. After that, we'll have the news. Uh, we'll break for a little bit, do some, you know, get, get you guys a chance to get more pizza, more drinks. Uh, Zach's going to be giving our first talk on inventory and patch management on the cheap. And our second talk is going to be by Adicom. Adicom? Sure. All right. Physical pen testing, black bag, show and tell. That's going to be an awesome one. Uh, good thing you guys are here because that one will not be streamed or recorded. Uh, 8.30 is our end time. Next month, nothing lined up. Um, we've got some tentative talks, but uh, really like to hear some, some from you guys. Um, you guys will get sick of hearing yeah, all yeah. of us <laughs> over and over. So um, get, hit us up at Slack if you got an idea. It doesn't have to be, you know, groundbreaking NSA level exploit, you know. Any, anything goes. If you've got 10 minutes, if you've got half an hour, anything. Feel free to come up. <coughs> All right, so someone bothering you, have an idea. This is how you get a hold of us. These are the board members. Um, everyone's here tonight except Brandon. Um, website is secic.org. Email contact at secic.org. Twitter is at sec underscore IC. And we've got a bit.ly link up there for our YouTube. So bit.ly slash secic underscore YouTube. Uh, if you haven't done so yet, go there and subscribe. We're trying to get 100 subscribers so we can get an actual good URL. That'd be awesome. Talk to us on Slack. Uh, today we hit 50, 50 people. We're, we're big time. Um, if you aren't on Slack yet, go to secic.org. Uh, you'll either see Slack at the top or just keep scrolling. Um, you'll see a link. You, you enter your, your email address, hit sign up. It'll it'll send you uh, it'll send you an acceptance email. So, uh, if you haven't done so already, Slack's kind of kind of our hub. That's that's where that's where all the magic happens. Okay. Speaking of which, uh, here's a screenshot of Slack. Uh, just want to let you guys know we've got a bunch of channels. So uh, feel free to poke around. If you just if you're in Slack, you hit this channels here, and it'll show you all the public channels. And um, you know we've got. Events and cons, where we try and try and uh, figure out upcoming events and cons. Figure out uh, we've got a ride sharing one for getting to events and cons. We've got red team, we've got blue team, we've got learning resources. Hobbies is just kind of kind of random stuff. Um, so feel free to poke around and um, you know talk to us. Shared job channel with SecDSM too. Yeah, yeah. So the top the top two, it's actually kind of neat. Um, the Sec IC Sec DSM is just a general shared one that's shared with Sec DSM, and the top one is also shared. That's a jobs channel. So, um, unfortunately, that means that not all the jobs are going to be in Eastern Iowa, but 
uh, pretty Iowa centric. At, at least it's either either Iowa or remote in there. So upcoming meetings next month uh, on Tuesday, March thirteenth, we've got our friends from Sec Midwest up in Cedar Rapids. So um, go check them out. They're at the True North building. Uh, then on March 20th is our next meeting right here. And March 22nd next week or next month is SEC DSM in Des Moines. Um, again, if you're looking for, for ride sharing to get to get tied to Cedar Rapids or Des Moines, uh, feel free to you know post in Slack and, and we'll figure something out. Is there a SEC uh, DSM on the 15th? Is it? Is that the is it that the week ahead of us? Uh, oh, I, I, fail. <laughs> up. Yeah. I can't read a calendar. All right, upcoming cons. Um, state, same ones as before. B sides Iowa in April 14th. That's in Des Moines. That's Des Moines at Grandview. We have yep. some amazing talks. Yes. Uh, yeah. That we have to weed through. So awesome talks. Um, whatever whatever is finalized will be be great material. ThoughtCon in Chicago. Um, I know a bunch of people from Sec DSM and, and a number of us are planning on going. So that'll be a good one for uh, figuring out ride sharing and, and uh, hotel sharing and stuff. So, and then Circle City Con, same thing. Um, that one's kind of we we bring the we bring the the group there. So I think we had like a dozen people between Sec DSM and Sec IC last month or last year. <coughs> um, also uh, at that one. Sec DSMs won the black badge two years in a row. It'd be awesome if we could beat them. Just saying, just saying. Events and cons in SEC. Uh, speaking of which, SEC IC CTF team. Um, if you're interested in participating in CTF type stuff, uh, no experience needed. Um, we've got a Slack channel, or just hit us up in Slack and, and we can coordinate. Uh, upcoming events. Um, CDC, ISU, CDC internal, it's in March. B-sides, we'll have a, have a CTF in April. And then April 21st, the following weekend, is the is another CDC event. The CDC events are uh, held by ISU, and they're, they're pretty awesome. The IT Olympics one is actually going to be high schoolers. The CDC internal, that's going to be uh, internal ISU students, so um, college level. And then they're always looking for red teamers. You don't have to have a lot of experience to show up, bring a laptop, and sit next to Tom. Yeah, yeah sit next to Tom and just copy what he does. <laughs> if you can read that fast. All right, up next, financial transparency. Zach, I see Newton Jobs. Okay, so from last month, uh, we got a bank account. Uh, we do have a balance now. Um, you'll, see, you'll see these asterisks. Uh, so previous months, we were quite a bit in the hole, but what we talked about doing is uh, we kind of took that on as donations that we had put in to build the bank account. So you can see the previous balance was $40. Uh, we got a very nice check from uh, SecDSM as well as someone from here. We really appreciate that from both. Uh, let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> And then uh, between now and last month, we sold nine badges. Those are five dollars a piece. If you want to buy a badge, talk to Zach or one of us. Uh, again, those are five dollars. And so that put us at a total of six hundred and sixty-five dollars this morning. However, since we were unable to find a sponsor, we did go into that budget uh, to buy pizza. So go ahead and uh, buy a badge or or hit one of one of us up. So let's go to the news next. Uh, so, uh, in the news, uh, between now and last month, um, there was a uh, new service called uh, Onion.Top. Basically what it was is it allows you to use the regular web to get um, to tour, and basically it's just a proxy service. And what it did does is uh, it looks for uh, Bitcoin wallet addresses, and what it does is change those to its own. So if you, let's say you're trying to do a transaction on there online, it changes it to theirs. They Money and it didn't go to who you thought it was. Uh, it's estimated that they think that they uh, had stolen so far. I didn't check the wallet uh, this morning, uh, but over twenty-two thousand dollars that they had managed to do that. So, yeah, keep an eye on that. Um, the next thing I'm sure everyone heard about uh, was uh, the new uh, Indian character that was crashing iPhones and other uh, iMessage and other uh, iOS apps. Um, there is a fix. I don't know if it's come out yet, but it was, it was uh, uh, being worked on. 
Um, you can see the character there. Basically what it did is it crashed your app. And uh, if you try to get into certain apps, uh, I know iMessage was one of them, there's others as well, uh, it wouldn't let you in. In order to get back in, you had to have a friend send you a message and then delete that chain so you could get in. Uh, the next thing, uh, so the Department of Justice uh, just took down a uh, huge uh, carding operation. Um, the forum was called Infraud. Uh, they were originally on uh, the internet, uh, infraud.cc and infraud.ws, but uh, they kind of grew pretty fairly large and things got heated there, so they moved away to, uh, to Tor. Um, however, they still got taken down. You can see. Um, here, that was the operation name. People always like to know that, Operation Shadow Web. And then this was kind of the org chart, per se, uh, of the uh, uh, operation. And the guys in red are who they've caught, and then the ones are who they're still working on. Um, there was 36 suspects, as you can probably read. Uh, I think there was like 13 different countries. I can't remember the exact number. All right, uh, the next one. So kind of funny, uh, on... Uh, uh, February 6th of uh, this month is called Safer Internet Day. Uh, apparently there was a bad uh, virus definitions that were put out for Bitdefender, which crashed uh, the antivirus. So uh, they worked uh, on that, uh, updated it and whatnot, got that fixed. Um, you can see the different uh, uh, error messages that appeared on that. And then finally, uh, an Australian man uh, uh, ha uh, is accused of hacking uh, a car company called GoGet. It's a, a version of Uber, I guess. Um, his primary goal was to get free rides, but what he did end up getting uh, customer data. Uh, the, they did track it down to him. He has been uh, detained or arrested, I guess. Uh, but then they also uh, did find malware on the website. However, uh, they're not sure if it was him or not. They're still investigating that. So. Finally, we've got jobs. Does anybody here know of a position? Are they looking for a job or anyone heard anything that might be coming? Anybody hiring? Anybody yeah, hiring? ProCircular is going to be looking for some red team interns for the summer. ProCircular, red team? Experience level? Interns. 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 Yeah. Interns. Passion. 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 One of the former university guys works in uh, Sutter Health in Sacramento was texting me last month about a bunch of jobs I have open. So if you want to move to sunny Sacramento, Sutter Health has Anybody Anybody looking? That's terrible. <laughs> no? Everybody's happy? Okay. I'm still looking for one. So uh, I graduated this May. Um, information security, uh, rather information systems major. Uh, I just got my security qualification past uh, winter. So uh, yeah. Red team, blue team, both, either, uh, either, either, one. either one, okay? A pain team. Right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Purple team. <laughs> All right, so the talks are up next, and uh, go ahead and get some pizza, get some drinks, and go from there.